Hello, my name is Evan Wilcox from Wilfrid Laurier University. I was awarded the Garfield Wesson Award for my master's research on the lakes in between Inuvik and Tuktoyaktuk. I've always been curious as how things worked and always enjoyed the outdoors, which has made Arctic research a great fit for me. I first went there in 2015 as a part of my undergrad, and I really enjoyed the fieldwork and the hospitality of the people in Inuvik and other researchers. We have no idea about the variability in the hydrology of these lakes, so we put some water level recorders in the lakes and we measured the water going out of the lakes. The lake water levels looked like for 2017, with the larger lake shown in blue and the smaller one shown in green. After the initial snowmelt period, we see that for the two major rainfall events, the larger lake had a much smaller rise in water level relative to the smaller lake. I've got them drawn out over here and you can see that they have roughly the same size basin despite them being quite different sizes. This would mean that the amount of water running into them is about the same which means the lake which is smaller is of course going to see a larger rise in water level. We think that the size of the basin relative to the size of the lake may be the controlling factor for the hydrology of these lakes. Since coming back from the field, I've upgraded to my PhD and I'll be doing a lot more research now and describing the hydrological variability of these lakes across a much broader region based on the hypothesis which we generated from the what lake water balances we did in 2017. Uh, I'd like to thank A. Coons and Garfield Weston Foundation for this award. It means a lot to me to know that my research is being valued by other people who care about the North and what's happening there. I'd like to thank the Trail Valley crew who I've spent the last three years doing work up there with. It's been a, a really amazing experience to be up there. And I'd like to thank my supervisors, Dr. Phil Marsh and Dr. Brent Wolf. Thank you.